on YouTube. So. <laughs> well, we'll see what happens. Let's start with Bray Wyatt because I want to ask your thoughts on his new custom-made belt because it's, it seems a little bit polarizing. I posted something on uh, Twitter responding to you, I think. You were asking for thoughts on it. And I, I responded and I said uh, something along the lines of WWE is hurting the development of their characters in favor of selling merchandise. Uh, and that's my opinion. And uh, some people on Twitter responded to me and said, oh, what about the Smoke and Skull belt? What about that? To me, it's completely different. And, and you know what I notice on Twitter a lot of the times is people try to make an – they try to use an example that's not – at all, you know, equal to what yeah. you're discussing, but they're reaching, but they're trying. So Bray Wyatt to me is not this era's Stone Cold Steve Austin. Steve Austin became popular. Austin 316, the T-shirt in the crowd. So he always wore whatever his new T-shirt was. A different character. Bray Wyatt is supposed to be this era's Undertaker. Did you ever see the Undertaker on television wearing an Undertaker T-shirt, going to the ring to cut a promo, going to the ring for a match? anything and the answer is no you didn't uh it's so blatantly obvious that they're using bray wyatt as a corporate shill merchandise seller character when he's supposed to be this new scary this era undertaker they're using him to show to to, to to sell merchandise what are your thoughts i don't even know that they made foam smoking skull belts back then i don't yeah, even i'm not know, sure i don't even know that they sold the damn things because yeah. replicas were not a big thing for several more years after this. There were the occasional people that would be able to have them, but I don't remember a foam smoking skull belt. Maybe I'm wrong, but I'm with you. I, I've said this often. Like these wrestlers come out always in when they're not in their gear in a t-shirt, promote like dress like a human man. Now that being said, there are people that wear those shirts out. Sure. I'm not saying people who wear wrestling shirts aren't human. I'm saying nobody wears the same thing on the same night every single week like that. Like, people dress differently. I I about stood up and cheered a few months ago when Io Shirai, when she was a babyface, came out and did a moonsault and was wearing jeans because she wasn't scheduled to wrestle. Why right. Why would she be in her gear? Why would she be in, in her merch shirt? She was in her regular clothes. It made a lot of sense. I, yeah, they, and they do this a lot. Seth Rollins is was one of the worst too. Yeah, but now he's turning heel, so he's wearing black now. Yeah, well, he's always but wearing I, black, but still. Yeah, I could even I could even accept the T-shirt thing, just because again, if you look back in the Attitude Era, a lot of them wore their wore their T-shirt back then. DX always did. Steve Austin always did. I can kind of let that go. The fact that they had Bray Wyatt as part of Firefly Funhouse. Like he's going to make a big announcement. You know, I have something new to to, to add to uh, to the show here. And then he pulls out this sixty five hundred dollar. And I'm sorry. I'm sure people uh, uh, are big fans of the guy that produced it. It looks like a bag of shit to me. It looks terrible. And and I I can't understand why somebody would want to pay even six hundred and fifty dollars, let alone sixty five hundred dollars U S for that bag of shit. And the way that he he lifted it up, like this is a, a new you know feature on. I just didn't like the whole thing. I thought this is just very corporate, you know, merchandise shilling, uh, and the wrong guy should be doing it. And that's my opinion. Yeah, I mean, at, at least it's not him saying, "Hey, go buy this" type of thing. But it, it he is, might as well. Have. He might as well. Have. It's very transparent. I'll say this: they're going to make their money back that they spent making that belt. At the very least, because th there will be some dopes that buy it.